Hey everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. Back in the late 1970s and early 80s, I loved watching Happy Days, and while I didn't catch the first few seasons when they originally aired on TV, I would fall in love with those early episodes later on when I caught them in reruns. And one of the characters that showed up fairly regularly during the first few seasons was Bag Zombrowski, played by Neil J. Schwartz. Now in this video, I take a look at Schwartz's role on Happy Days, as well as dig into what he's been doing since leaving that classic TV show. Before Happy Days, Schwartz had appeared in a number of other television shows such as the anthology TV series Love American Style in 1973. Ironically, Love American Style is also where the Happy Days pilot was first aired. There was also the PBS series Hollywood Television Theater adaptation of Steam Bath. Now I've got to say, I've never seen Steam Bath as I was only two in 1973, and the only shows I watched on PBS as a kid anyway were Sesame Street and Mr. Rogers. But this show seems pretty weird to me. Apparently the premise was that God is an attendant at a steam bath, and the souls of the recently departed come there to obsess about the concerns they were dealing with in their mortal life. For me, however, I first saw Schwartz as the character Bag on Happy Days. He was a member of a gang called the Demons, and at times he seemed to be an antagonist for Richie, Ralph, and Potsy. In fact, he first appeared on Happy Days in an episode from the first season called Deadly Dares. And in that episode, Richie and Potsy are trying to get Fonzie to help them join the Demons. To join, Richie and Potsy have to complete a series of dares, including dressing up as a woman during one of those dares. In another episode from Season 1 called Give the Band a Hand, Bag is seen as the drummer in the band with Richie, Potsy, and Ralph. So he was a friend of the guys, wasn't he? Probably, like most relationships, their friendship would fluctuate over time. With that said, his character would be short-lived on Happy Days, appearing in just nine episodes. Around the same time he was appearing in those nine episodes of Happy Days, Schwartz was also grabbing roles in other shows that were on at the time, such as a brief appearance in a Season 2 episode of Barney Miller called The Psychiatrist. He was also in an episode from the second season of What's Happening in 1977. Now it appears that after a few of those one-off appearances in TV shows in the late 80s, that Neil decided to change directions and pursue a different line of work, that of being a realtor. And it's a career, it seems, that he's had a lot of success with. In fact, he was the recipient of the Greater Las Vegas Association of Realtors Realtor of the Year Award in 2009. His wife and real estate partner Ronnie received that same award in 2016. Now here's one last picture of Neil J. Schwartz as Bag from Happy Days, joking around with Marsha, the car hop at Arnold's. Now I really loved those first couple of seasons of Happy Days and thought Bag was a fun character. I would have loved to seen his character stick around and be in more episodes of Happy Days than he was, but with that said, it really seems like Mr. Schwartz found a career in real estate that he loved and excelled at, and that makes me really happy. How many of you remember Bag from Happy Days, or even better yet, how many of you ever saw Steam Bath? That show just seems crazy to me. Now I look forward to reading your comments. Also, I would greatly appreciate it if you would consider subscribing to my YouTube channel where I generally make videos where I talk about pop culture from the 70s, 80s, and 90s. Now as always, thank you so much for watching, stay safe out there, and have a great day.